let's learn how to add transparent fills and offset paths to live text in Illustrator in this simple tutorial. In a blank canvas, I'm first going to add my background. So I'm going to place in an image. So file, place, locate my image, select it and press place. Let's click on the canvas and let's use the align tools, align to artboard and we'll just horizontally and vertically center align this. Then with it selected, object, lock and selection. Now come to my type tool. In paragraph, let's center align this text and click anywhere just to create some point type. So I'm going to type out the word sunset, select with selection tool. I'm gonna to scale this up using shift and alt or option, clicking and dragging out. So let's make this a little bigger and let's apply a font to this. So let's go with canvas script and using the align tools that center horizontally and vertically. With the text selected, come to your appearance panel and if you can't find it, window appearance, select type and let's add a new fill and then come into characters by double clicking and on the fill let's just remove that using the delete icon and then come back to type. So select this added fill layer, hold out our option and then click and drag out a duplicate fill and just click and drag down until you see that blue line and release to create the second fill. So this second fill is going to act as our stroke, our offset path. So set the opacity of the first fill to 0% and click enter. And then the second fill, go ahead and apply a color. So I'm gonna select white. And then with the fill selected, come to effect, path, and offset path. And let's just set an offset of 20 for now. We can always change this later in the appearance panel. So you don't need to be too precious. Press okay. And then finally, under characters, come down to opacity and select twice to knock out group. Make sure there's a tick there. And now you've created a transparent fill. So let's just put this to the test. Grab selection tool, select the text. And as you can see, if we move this around over the image, the image protrudes through the transparent fill. We can also add transparency to the offset path layer and flip it. So make sure you go to object, unlock all. So now you'll have your text layer and your background image. So with selection tool, click and drag over the two and group these together. So right click and group. Now come to your direct selection tool and select group selection tool and then come in and double click on the text layer to select it in appearance panel. Select type and now we're going to flip this. So we'll set the opacity to 100% and then we'll set the opacity of the white fill which is the offset path fill to 0% and click enter. And finally, let's select off this using selection tool. So click off the canvas and then select to select the whole group. And then in appearance panel under the opacity default of the group, select and turn on the knockout group. And now the offset path layer has had a transparency effect applied to it. So if I just quickly zoom out, command or control minus and drag this group down, there you go. You can see now that the offset path is cut through the image to the background. And remember, this remains fully editable. So at any time, you can go back in with group selection tool, come into type. And remember, if we click this offset path, we can increase or decrease this number accordingly. And there you have it. Super simple, transparent fill and offset paths for live text in Illustrator. I hope you found this helpful. And if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Keep on designing and I will see you for the next tutorial.